right here is EcoFlow's new plug and play 1200 watt microinverter. Now this is really cool because it's a plug and play solar setup. Now I live in Utah where it's now legal to have a 1200 watt plug and play solar setup. So right here I have 800 watts of solar panels plugged into the microinverter and then I have that plugged into a dedicated circuit going into my house. Now, in order for the system to work properly, I did have to upgrade to a smart meter. So I reached out to Rocky Mountain Power and they installed this smart meter for free. Now, what this essentially does is it zeroes out your smart meter. So you can see I'm pulling zero power right now, meaning I am not being charged anything by my power company. Now, this system is producing about 700 watts right now. And the base load in my house is less than 700 watts. That's why my power meter was showing zero watts. I am sending a little additional power to the grid and I am not getting credit for it. And I cannot roll back my power meter. I would have to join the Rocky Mountain grid tie agreement plan in order to roll back my power meter and to get credits for the power produced. Now, typically my house has around a 500 to 600 watt base load running all the time. By connecting this grid tie inverter, whenever the sun is shining, I'm able to offset that load and save money on my power bill. Now, Utah was actually the first state to allow a plug and play solar setup like this good for 1200 watts. But I recently read an article that other states are looking to do the same thing, starting with Connecticut. So hopefully other states will soon allow you to have plug and play solar setups. 